If you'd like to be in with a chance of winning a free pack, all you have to do is be subscribed to the channel and comment down below and one winner will be picked at the end of the month. Konnichiwa and arigato gozaimasu for watching this video. I have here a £15 Japanese Pokemon booster box. Well, it's come in a bag, so it's not really a box. And we are gonna open it up and see what is inside. I haven't looked in here, so don't know what to expect, but, ooh, here we go. So we've got a thick wood of cards. That looks quite cool. Poke Maniac one. And a couple of boosters as well. So it's like vivid voltage. Um, gosh, I don't even know these ones. Wow, some of these are fairly old. Tag team, very, very cool artwork. There we go. So we've got we've got six booster packs. So for 15 pounds, we've got six Japanese booster packs and a whole set of cards. I'm gonna save the cards to the end and we're gonna open up these and see if we get anything good. Let's go. So six booster packs, here we go in no particular order. Let's get straight into them. And I'm pretty sure when you buy a Japanese booster box, you get one pack that is guaranteed a hyper rare, you know, like a, a rainbow card or a golden card or some kind of, you know, alternate art. So, ooh, that is a very cool Pikachu. So we'll have to see, because I'm not holding my breath for any of these, because the chances are that they're, they've already taken the good pack out and these are just remaining ones. So possibly, possibly we could pull something good. If you like the look of any of these cards and you guys want them, by all means I will send them out. Here we go, two packs in and nothing special, but I am kind of excited to see what he's left in the little, the mini booster for me. Some of these artworks are super cool. Guys, it's your boy Simmy, back at it with another video, one from the back. And I just want to say, as always, thank you so much for everyone that watches this channel. Even if you just watch for a couple of minutes, I always appreciate you guys. And if you're not already, please go ahead and follow me on Instagram too, because I put quizzes up every single day, as well as posts as well. So if you think you know your Pokemon knowledge very well, oh, let me test you, let me test you. So far, these packs have been absolutely <laughs> terrible. Although that is a really cute Magnemite. He's in some kind of junkyard that is really cool and again because they're in japanese i really don't know too many of them lick a tongue and there we go there's a hollow victini i think that one is that's super cool that is super cool i'm going to put one of these i'm going to put this one in the booster pack for the people that comment on the videos as well so down to the last two this is a super cool artwork look at this this is the tag team you've got blastoise and piplup there very very cool here we go one from the back. And these are quite, you know, if you're into collecting Japanese booster packs and you don't have any, this, this box may be, ooh, second holo, there we go. This box may be something to get your hands on. 15 pounds for six booster packs is not that bad. And there's no duplicates either. And if it's something you just want to collect and look at, then I think this is actually a good way to start. So two holos from the six, and this is the last pack. Looks like it's got a McDonald's M on the front. Sponsored. Ooh. Phonix. Some kind of bug. And, wow, it's not a holo, but that is a really cool holo card. Absolutely awesome. So, from those six packs, we didn't get to anything too special. Two holos and this holo, which I might sleeve as well, because it looks very, very nice. So, I'm gonna put them up there, and let's check out this fun little booster pack. This is, this looks awesome. And remember, you know, if you're buying these, these kind of things, don't expect to make too much money from them. I'm gonna put the sleeved ones right to the very back, I think. Yeah, don't, don't ever expect too much from these because, you know, people know what they're putting in and stuff and you're, you're never gonna make money for them. It is all about the love. So let's see what we get. Grandma, nick it. Another Pikachu. That's a, that's a really cool card, though. Slugma. A Ghastly. Oh, and that is, I believe, the CP6 Ghastly. You can see down the bottom there, it's got the first edition. That looks really cool. Yeah, CP6. So that was the Japanese version of the 25th anniversary, which is super cool. Single Strike Mankey. I mean, if you guys have a lot of cards at home as well, this is definitely worth doing if you want to just kind of get rid of them 
you know, as long as you're not ripping people off and you're not putting them at a ridiculous price, like, this is this is something cool for someone to open. Like, I enjoy doing these things. And there's the Haunter as well. Awesome. That is cool. And here we go into some of the sleeved cards at the back very soon. Oh, imagine finding that in your bedroom. Oof. Psychic energy. Oh, I'm skipping. Sorry, boys. Here we go. And need a ran in the CP6 as well. I'll keep that. Very cool looking Raichu as well. Looking up to the skies. That is super cool. Okay, and then we're on to our reverse hollows in the sleeves. Wow! A Japanese Vile Plume GX. This card looks absolutely awesome. I'm going to do a video very, very soon on Japanese and English cards because I really do think Japanese cards are a lot, lot cooler. So let's see what else we've got. Ooh, another sick V. A, oh, I can't remember what this one's called. But a couple of hollows here as well. Electrode, looking very good. Looks like someone's knitted that, that's awesome. A Landorus, I believe, a hollow. So we have, you know, through this pack, we have pulled quite a few hollows, which is pretty cool and a hollow toxic croak as well so here's what we got all together we've got the ho -Oh, we've got a couple of hollows that we pulled and then a couple of hollows that we got in the packs the v and then the vile plume gx as well remember if you guys want to be in with the chance of winning some of these cards and i tell you what i'm going to put this vile plume gx in next month's winners pack so if you guys want to be with the chance of winning a pack all you have to do is just be subscribed to the channel leave a comment on absolutely any video and you could be in with the chance and once again thank you guys so much for watching it's your boy simmy and i'll see you in the next one peace